to get some perspective from you. We're coming down to the last few minutes of trade and it has turned out to be a really, really solid day. Uh, the complaint can be that, yes, mid-caps took a bit of a breather, but no such issues for large caps. It's a completely large cap driven move. Uh, a near 1200 point rally on the bank nifty leading it from the front and you know all banking stocks participating it's not just one or two names it's across the board icici bank four percent up indusind three percent sbi three percent access two and a half kotak mahindra bank coming back from the blows that it received last week uh hdfc bank up about one percent so it's sort of all the soldiers marching in together in fact beyond banks even uh, bajaj finance found some takers today after the drubbing that it got on Friday. So strong uh, showing from the, the banks. TCS, Reliance, uh, these are some of the other names. LNT, these are some of the other non-bank large cap names. Airtel, that also contributed to the uh, big screen party today. But on the flip side, yeah, you've got some severe reactions on the downside. There's no taking away from that. HCL Tech on the earnings, 6% lower. Not much improvement there throughout the day. And of course, uh, Apollo Hospitals on this whole deal with Advent and the merger with the promoter entity. Market still having lots of questions. 4.5% on that well, stock. Well, that's right. Quite a few stocks, though, move around should be in today's trading session. Lloyd's Engineering Work, we don't talk about that stock very often, but that stock was up close on 10% on massive volumes. Jamna Auto was up 7.5%, so big up move out there. Irida was up close to around 7%. Bank of Maharashtra up 5%, so some of those big volume movers in trade. On the flip side, IDFC first, IDFC Bank, both of them down 4 to around 4.5%, and it's a rarity, sale, didn't sale today. That stock, in fact, ended with a cut of around 3%. I should also mention one more, AU Small Finance Bank. Remember, yes. the brokerages feel that this is the one uh, that will move the quickest, perhaps, from being a small finance bank to a universal bank. And by the end of it, there was a nice move, 7.5% on AU Small. Absolutely. And, uh, you know, uh, very, very rich market in terms of uh, stock reactions. So, lots to do, lots to track. It's a wrap on this edition of Closing Bell from all of us here. Goodbye. Thank you for watching. Uh, but uh, stay right here with us because markets forward will pick up on all the action in just a bit.